All right, y'all, there's some more news that just came out at about 1014. Um, basically, we have our first Transformers product reveal of the Takara Tomi 40th Anniversary Project, Our Origin. The official website has been updated with images and videos of the new Kakuri, Kak, no, Karakuri statue, KS-01 Optimus Prime. So basically, Optimus Prime will transform with the push of a button. He just automatically transform. They even have a promotional video. Not going to take the video, but I'll put a link. Uh, in the description to the website and you can see it for yourself and you can make a decision um it's quite an original release kind of a transforming statue when you press the button on the pedestal optimus prime transforms automatically from all to robot mode um uh, after the transformation optimus prime will speak phrases in japanese dubbed by tesho genda the original japanese voice of g1 prime and his eyes light up it seems that the figure can't be separated from the stand <laughs> Pre-orders will be available in summer of 2024 in Japan between June and September, with an estimated release in the spring of 2025 between March and May. Price is yet to be determined. Ah, y'all can keep it, but let's look at the pictures. So the truck mode looks pretty nice. You can see it's all plastic wheels, so it probably doesn't really roll or move. But it does look nice. Like I wouldn't mind seeing this as something you could, you know, just pull away or something like that. And you know, um, there it is from the back. You know, and yeah, it's probably held down by screws and a motor. It's a lot of stuff, you know, going on in there. And then, of course, somebody's going to be able to free it from there. But here's Prime from the front with the gun. Again, he looks okay. And now we're going to show off the transformation. And basically, he transforms just like Optimus Prime. That's it. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Nothing special. Nothing out of the ordinary. Um, is he posable? From what I can tell, no. It looks like a, a fixed pose. Um, and you, when you transform the gun, just points in the air uh there he is in the back there's a lot of you know kind of hollowness and you can see how everything folds up but i have to admit it does look pretty nice for a little statue and everything like that i'd love to see how much this costs but like i said there's no cost yet and you can see it from the top yeah you can see where the arms and the legs don't move so you know and maybe i could be wrong but hey that's what i see so yeah this is a pretty cool uh thing it's kind of like having robeson light super light Robeson, like junior or something you know you want to get the real deal you need to just go ahead and get your Robeson. and even then to me that's it's so uh i guess the word niche on me i wouldn't i wouldn't even bother with that either um dollars can be well spent on better toys that i would have to transform myself but i'd rather spend it on toys that i know overall are going to keep my interest and in. something that automatically changes yeah it'd be hey look at this for a few seconds and I'll be right back to flipping Earthrise Optimus Prime until I get that SS86 Commander Class Optimus Prime. But it's a pretty neat statue, 40th anniversary, so it's expected, but it's not going to come out to 2025. So maybe they're trying to see how much they need to make. So what are your thoughts? Again, leave them down in the comments below. This is Super Robot Ed. Please like, subscribe, and share. And again, we'll see you soon with more news and reviews. Bye-bye.